Hey there guys, you will probably notice two things um, right at the beginning. First of all there's a console message and second of all I'm not using a gold gun. Um, that's because of I'm playing on the um, uh, 4 Delta 1 version of Modern Warfare 3. So it's called uh, IW5M I think so yeah. Um, I saw it, um, a couple of days, maybe weeks back, that they released that. It was just a couple of days back. Yeah, they released that, and um, you guys probably know that from Modern Warfare 2. It's the only um, a real available network for Modern Warfare 3. So, yeah, um, I decided to give it a try in Modern Warfare 3. Uh, did I just say Modern Warfare 3? I don't know, uh, but I meant Modern Warfare 2. So, yeah. I decided to give it a try here. And yeah, that's the gameplay you are seeing. Um, if you don't know anything about that, it's basically just, you know, they deliver the same the same uh, multiplayer capabilities that Infinity Ward does, but um, it's a completely different network, so your stats are gone um, if you play on that network. And yeah, you have to level up again you have to um uh you have to uh yeah you have to again um oh my god what's the word um to get the weapons and stuff again oh my god i can't remember what that what's the, what they're called um yeah so you have to level up again and stuff like that um to get all your weapons back and your equipment and stuff like that and your level of course so that's kind of a setback, but there um, and another thing, there is no matchmaking. You, uh, there are only dedicated servers. That's a great thing, actually. Um, and as you can see, I'm playing on uh, Sanctuary, I think it's called. I'm playing with the M4. It was but by the time I played this, it was the only weapon except for the M16, the uh, N16 that had uh, unlocked. Yeah, unlocked. That was where I was searching for. Um, so yeah, I had to play with that and. Uh, Normally I play with the specialist kill streak package, but yeah, I hadn't unlocked that <laughs> too, so I had to play with the assault strike package, and I had to use the standard assault um, kill streaks, so UAV, predator, and helicopter, and yeah, it's actually just cool to play on the um, IW5M or 4 Delta One network. Um, to install it, you just have to um, to download one file, put it into your um, Modern Warfare 3 directory, double click it, and bam, it's installed. Uh, you have to have an account on 4 Delta 1 um, to be able to log in, but yeah, that's just a minor thing. Once you have the account, you log in, and you're uh, you're good to go. You can play on the 4 Delta 1 network. And it just works. You have to start Modern Warfare um, with another file that um, that will be placed in the Modern Warfare directory. But yeah, that's just it's simple. It's very easy to connect, and yeah, you, then you're good to go. So I did it, and that was I think my second game on the network. And yeah, it was my first time playing Sanctuary actually. So. Um, <laughs> I was kind of confused uh, where I could go to or where the enemies would be, so I'm a little bit campy here, but I just have to be, you know, if you don't know the map, you can't run around and kill everyone, that, <laughs> that would be hard. But I'm getting some nice kill streaks here, and I think I'm ending up with something like 60 to 8 or something like that, so it's it was just a great game, and... One thing I think why I could actually play great was there were no cheaters there. And there are um, not that many cheaters on the um, the 4 Delta 1 network. I've seen about two, I think. Uh, uh, two guys I would, I would say they definitely cheated. But there is a voting system so you can actually um, vote uh, for them to be kicked. And it worked every time. After 15 seconds, they were gone. So, yeah, you got one or you got killed one or two times by a cheater, but then they were just kicked, and bam, you're good to go to play a nice, clean round. So that's just great. Um, and with a dedicated server, there is no um, host advantage. You know, everyone 
basically has the same um, connection because someone from the USA wouldn't connect to a um, server in the European area because their ping would be horrible. So basically all the guys that want to play together are from the same area or uh, almost the same area so the pings are yeah, almost the same. You can actually see your real ping um, if you got uh, uh, look at the scoreboard. So that's just cool. I don't know why they didn't implement that in Call of Duty. That's just ridiculous. But yeah. So yeah, um, if there are no no big differences in the ping and if there is no host advantage, the game basically is so much easier. And I said again, basically, I'm sorry for that. Um, the game is so yeah, it's so much more fun to play, you know? I... I don't know. Um, like knifing, there's always... if the if you're a host, you can basically knife everyone and there's no chance that they're gonna knife you. Um, so... <laughs> that's, that's just gun. So, yeah. There is no... Um, there's no lag compensation or stuff like that. So, yeah. It's just your connection matters. If you have a horrible ping, you have a horrible ping. Okay, a, a guy with a uh, horrible ping is hard to hit, but um, you can if you can vote vote to kick him. Um, that seems mean, but I don't I don't think you want to play with a guy that has a ping of 500. Um, you you basically can't hit him, and they will you know they will just teleport all over the map. That's just pointless. So kick him, and you're good to go. And yeah, that I think that are just two things that are great. The connection isn't isn't of advance uh, advantage, and there are basically no cheaters. And I said again, basically, I'm sorry. Um, <coughs> I'm sorry, I had to clear my throat. <coughs> so yeah, that that's just a great thing about this, and I think that's why I um. Uh, why I had no problem to get such a high score. Um, actually, I had I think three, four, five games after that, and in every game I had such a high score. Even on maps I uh, didn't play often, like um, I played Oasis. I almost had an yeah, that was even a multi kill. Um, I I never I played Oasis in single player mode, but um, never on in multiplayer, and I had. A crazy high score on Oasis, but it was a very, very, very long game. I think it was a 500 points domination game, so it just took half an hour or something like that, but yeah, I almost hit a Moab there, but there was one guy that was just too good for me, so yeah. Um, yeah, and oh, about Moabs, yeah, I actually had um, two Moabs um, on this network on one day, so that's something I've never done uh, maybe I've done it once, but it's something I've never done on the real network from um, from Infinity Ward. So with a lag compensation gun and um, the good pings, you you can actually choose your server f um, with your ping. So if you see, okay, I would have a 60 ping on that server, you just go on that server and bam, you have a 60 ping the whole time. That's just wow. So. I don't have to play in a lobby where I have a 200 uh, ping of 200 and be owned because I can't play with a ping of 200. <coughs> I'm sorry, my my nose is kind of uh, I don't know, getting a little um sick I think, but yeah um. So this network is just a great experience, and I think you guys should really check it out. Um, I, I love the network and I will definitely play more there. Um, the only little setback is um, it's all dedicated servers, so the um, the admin from the dedicated server can yeah choose the um, the configuration of the server. So there are servers where there is very um, high XP rate, so you just have to kill I don't know um, two or three times with your gun and it will level up. So um, I accidentally um, played on a high XP server with my M4 and I um, brought it to level 31 in about an hour or so. <laughs> that was just ridiculously fast, but yeah, now I have a gold M4, that's just cool. Um, oh, and another setback, you can't... Uh, even uh, 
I can't do it. Um, I can't um, put servers in my favorites. I don't know why that doesn't work, but um, they will fix it. There. Um, it even got an update uh, yesterday, so yeah, it's they are updating very fast. So this feature will be available, I think, in in a short time. The voting feature for maps doesn't work either uh, either right now, but that's okay. Um, they are still they just released it, so it's kind of a better thing. I don't know, um, but they they did a really great work. I really enjoyed this. Um, really enjoy this network. We'll be playing more there. I just can't get good gameplay there, or I can't get good gameplay. But the gameplay is just so freaking long that I can't um, can't record it for YouTube. Um, this uh, this gameplay is about I think 14 minutes. Yeah, 14 minutes. <laughs> I I didn't realize I was talking for 11 minutes now. So wow, that's cool. Yeah, this gameplay is 14 minutes, and because uh, they kind of changed the rules for the games. You know, domination isn't 200 points. It, most of the time it's 250 points, so a game is longer. And actually, the 50 points make the game much more. Um, much more fun because there are so much more twists to it, you know. Um, so yeah, um, it's kind of hard to get gameplay there. There are servers with a 500 point domination um, uh, limit, maximum, whatever you might call it. Uh, there are servers where you have to get, I think, almost 100,000 points in team damage. Oh, that's actually a very nice streak here, and that's just ridiculous. He's running into my gun, um, and yeah, I got two kills right now too. Uh, get more here, yeah, bam, spray down. So yeah, it's kind of hard to get um, uh, to get uh, gameplay for commentaries, and I don't think I don't know. Um, no one clicks on link with a gameplay that's 20 minutes long or something like that. So uh, I'm even a little afraid that no one will uh, listen to this. <laughs> but yeah, I just have to record it. Um. So yeah. Um. Did you guys check out this network? If you did, um, leave a um, comment in the comment section below. It would be pretty cool if you um, stated your experiences with this network. As I said, I think it's just a great network. It's just a great way of um, playing Modern Warfare 3. It's it's kind of, I think, it, it, it's maybe weird to say, but it's kind of, I think, this is how Modern Warfare 3 should have been played. <clears throat> you know, the matchmaking system is kind of a good idea, it doesn't work, but it's a good idea. So, it would have been a great system if they implemented it right, but they didn't, so it just sucks. But, yeah, if they would have put dedicated service in Modern Warfare 3, it could have been that game, and it would have been great, you know. So... Yeah, uh, I really hope you um, enjoyed this commentary and you will check out um, the IW5M or 4 Delta 1 network. Um, I'll put a link in the description for you to, to check it out. Um, and yeah, maybe we'll see on one of the, the battlefields in 4 Delta 1. <laughs> would be pretty great. Um, so yeah, leave a comment, leave a rating. A subscription would be pretty nice. Come on, I was talking for, fift uh, for 14 minutes, this is just... My voice is going to hell right now. And <laughs> yeah. So, as I said, I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, uh, here we go. Um, I'm Lost Link signing out.